Night, Thursday the night of November 2023. And we're in the outside Avery. And uh, some of the boats are still super duper comfortable enough to go onto the ground whilst I'm in here, which of course it should not be an issue. But Vikings are extremely nervous. Just, you know, they are quite delicate creatures, so they um, like normally staying high up. He's patient. He's been climbing around, tickling my ear. <laughs> Hello, you. Hello. What are you doing? They're all being sociable today. Hey, Sky Breeze. Hello, Sky Breeze. How are you today? That's patient again. Hello, baby. How are you? They're gorgeous creatures, they really are, and to see them from 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 an egg to fully fledged beings is a joy I will always treasure, a memory, memories that I treasure. Because all good things must come to an end, but <laughs> hello. There you are, you're gonna come and look at yourself in, in the camera. Huh? <laughs> and here's Ripple. Hey Ripple. The night. So you are well beyond fledgling, my darling. <laughs> We've got a reluctantly hello pumpkin. Where's my pumpkin? Hello, Peppy. Let me just get that off. That's yucky. Hello, darling. Hello. Where are you? Hello, baby. Hello. You still not willing to come out? Hmm? You are funny. There's pumpkin. There's Zebedee. It's okay. The water's at a level that's okay because they can get themselves out if they are stupid enough to get in. Somebody's nipping at my eyebrow. Face. And fudge. Fudge is going to go in the bag. Yes, maybe. Hello, Fudge. How are you feeling today after your trauma yesterday, you silly Billy? Zebedee, in the background. We have Bat there. Thankfully, Hope is up. Hasn't done a lot of um, grooming to sort its head feathers out. Hello, Fudge. Come on, it's okay. You can do it. Mm. Yeah. Okay, there you go. My little pip 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 squeak. You are such a little baby, aren't you? But you are now, look at it, it's the uh, 9th of November and you were born on the 2nd of October. You are well past the stage of fledging, my darling, but if you don't want to, it doesn't matter. There's no pressure, not in this world. Let me go for a little adventure in the spinach bag. Aren't you, darling? Yes, you are. Zebedee. Ventured in there, no doubt dream will come in. Hello, Max. Where's my Max? What are you doing in there? Are you resting in there? Young lady. Of course, without fail, we have Dream who wants to get into that. Oh, Pip, you sneak. Oh, no, that wasn't Pip. Oh, that was Zebedee. I thought Pip had taken off there, but <laughs> I thought I'd missed it. But no. Zebedee was uh, on the back, must be with Pip on the back. I thought Pip had blown off. But Pip, I can still feel on the back of my neck now. Pip is still hold up. Pip can play hard to check on Pip. So what are you still doing there? Pip has found a little, um, nice little, what, small, comfortable place to watch everything going on. Get a little, little few second flight into the nest. Hey, you did. Yes, you did, Pip. Did you do that, Pip? Yes, you did. You did, and I saw you. I did, and look at you, you look so proud of punch, puffed out your cheeks. Going, yeah, I did it, I did, I did, I did. Yeah, you're almost there, my darling. You're almost there, aren't you? Pip, pip, hooray. Pip, squeak. Do, 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 do. Don't, don't eat the feather, though. That's not very nice. Hmm? Oh, yeah, you ready to start feeding yourself now? Hmm? Hello. Hmm? Yeah. What's going here? Oh, uh, Pip's fledgling day. 
Hop that. There you go. Come on, hop. Hop. Hop, hop, hop. Come on, darling. Hop. There you go. One. And the other one. There you go. Well done, Pip. Now, you, my darling, have got a very interesting tail, so that's going to be easy to identify you. But the rest of you looks very similar to the others, doesn't it? Huh? Yeah. Mm. Hmm? You can go back. Go on, you can do it. Go on. Yay! Well done. Yeah. Ooh. Go on then, jump. Go on, you can do it. <laughs> Mum may be coming now to take a look, because Levy Cello does, does supervise the fledglings for them for the first few flights to make sure that they're um, A-OK. -okay. Right, yes, Mum, there you go. Hello, Levy Cello, here she comes. Here's your fledgling. Yeah. Pip, pip. as well. Yeah, this is it. It's a big time. Come on, darling. Oh, good boy, Jack. That's nice. Good boy. Yeah. Come on, Jack. Feed your baby. Feed your Come on. Come on. Good boy. Oh, no. Maybe he's looking for lemon jello. She's up here, let me tell us up there. Or no, she isn't. she's up there. Hello, let me tell her. Good boy, Jack. There you go. You might as well just feed it. Good boy, Jack. Oh, happy days. And here are lemon cellar two new eggs. Just to say that Pip is 38 days old, which is a good a good week past the point where you would see them fledging, yeah, making a good effort. And that doesn't surprise me because of course Pip was the last by four days and the sixth of six babies and did lose out a, little, a lot on the um, development stage. So our, our little darling Pip is a week probably behind, but there's no rush. There's no pressure. It doesn't matter. We don't mind, do we? Because nobody's going to remember once you start flying, Pip. Nobody's going to ever remember that you <laughs> were a little bit slow and a bit nesty. Nest, nest. But affected. Whatever. Come on, then. You're going to come out. you got to start flying. I know. Once you get the bug, who just... Would you stop nipping at me, please, um, Braveheart? Hey, hey, stop Braveheart. Would you stop? Get off. I don't want you nipping. No, I'm not going to. No, I'm not. Is this Zebedee? <laughs> they do love climbing my hair. This is Zebedee. Hello, darling. You don't bite me, do you, sweetie? You don't nip. No, no. Okay. Hello. And Braveheart's back on the phone. Ooh, just it on the phone. There we go. Now you're blocking the view. Well done, Braveheart. Thanks a lot. Come on. We're going to check on our gorgeous patch. And bolt, hello, look at you, yeah. We have a 20 day old little gorgeous hatch thing here. Hatch, who we saw. And we have a 24 day old bolt in the back there, pretending that he's done nothing wrong. I'm gonna get you two out to clean the nest. Right, Daddy? Yeah, shall we? Yeah, let's get you nest nest. Come on, baby. Sheila's got much more relaxed now. Sheila never stays in the nest when I've got the door open. That's nice to see. Hello, Sheila. You with your two little babies. How are you? I'm going to get them out to clean your nest, darling. Good girl. Good girl, Sheila. Oh, you've got a hatch in here. Oh, that's sweet. Do a little hatch. 
I'm not going to stove them now. I'll wait a little bit. I'll clean their nest out and then... I mean, clean the cage portion of the nest. And then I'll clean their box because the hatch is just too comfortable right now. Good girl, she has to come out. He gets the female to step on his back. And then uh, they do their little dance. And then she and Prince are going to do the old looking. And he's getting all ready. Yeah, see, step on his back, step on his back. And he does a little bit of tap, tap, tap. Hope is messing up their routine. Meanwhile, we have Bolt who's snuggled in, having a little nibble in my hand. And Hatch. Little Hatch. He's there, little darling. He's just snuggled in too. Beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. Precious little miracles. Miss hmm? yeah. Hope has had a boo boo on his mouth, but it's improved, thankfully. Thankfully, thankfully. That was a very weird um, injury. Mm -hmm. I've managed to uh, get to that stage a bit quicker. <laughs> Uninterrupted. It was uh, been a while, I guess. So, right, thanks. Look at Pip's got, I should call you polka dot. I hate because your tummy's got all these green dots on it, isn't it? Huh? Splotch. What do I call you, Splotch? No, you got Pip. Pip Squeak. Right? Look at you, look at Hmm. Right, so Sheila and Prince is too bold and hatch with a nice clean nest now. At the moment they're snuggling in my in, around my neck, I've got I'm not sure is that hatch. Can't quite make bolt is in this side. Somewhere. I can feel it at the back. Tucked in. The warmth. Yeah, well done. Look at you, you're a little bit crazy. Come on. Pip, 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 squeak. Are you going in? Oh. <laughs> so, excuse me, there's somebody already here, so we've got another. We're going to move into further in the back there to have a little snuggle. Oh. Yeah, I've got a. It's okay, it's okay, everybody, relax. I don't know who did that. There's. Nothing's up. They end up scaring each other. Somebody does one thing and they all just go flight. It's okay, everybody. It's all right. Relax. So everybody's called Bolt. It's a handy name. He wants to just go looking. Yeah, yeah. 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 So, hmm, this looks interesting. Your poor little cousin. Bolt. Is your top. <laughs> it's the dogs. Mm. It's the dogs. They'd quite like to be your friends before eat you. They'd be very good doggies. Jasper, Poppy, Jasper, and Margie. Pip, 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 squeak. Pip is. Wait, pip so how long? How did you say? 28 and. 38 days, because Pip is delayed. All the nursery budgies have settled for the night. <laughs> it is not late at all, but it's dark out and they've all just settled and there's old Fudge. I'm always going to take you to see. Uh, Fudge is by the entrance to where Max is. Max has decided to make a little home in there. And Pip had a nice outing, looking quite content. 
I think he just went to the house. And there's Jack. And we're going to look at Lemoncello on her eggs. Got one or two eggs now. There's Lemoncello. Look at you, mum of the eon century. Good girl. 